Okay, we're in the middle of a Gadata, discussing Shlomo Melech. So Gadata, we're on Chaf Aleph Amid Beis. Chaf Aleph Amid Beis. We are one, two, three, four, five, six lines from the bottom. Right? Oh, seven lines from the bottom. Remember on Nuna. My dixir by Yidabe Shleishas Alofin Marshal, by Yishiroi Hamisha Ve'elef was a thousand and five. Malami, Dama Shleimah called Dabba Ve'dabba Shal Torah Shleishas Alofin Marshal. Dabba was, Shlom was able to explain the Dibre Torah, the three thousand Mishalim, and I'll call Dabba Ve'dabar Shal Seifrim, and all the Halachic Dika, the Seifrim, the Rabbanan Dika decrees, Chamesh Ve'elef Taimim, he's able to give 1,005 reasons. Dabba Shlom, my dixir, the Yosef Shahoya Kehelis Chacham, Oid lime dasis am, the easing, the chiker, the ticking, mushlem harbe. It says he listened and he sought out, he ticking mushlem harbe, many mushalem. Lime dasis am, the agmre bisbarism, lime dasis am. It means the agmre bisimani taima. He went ahead and he taught the simani tomim, the truck. The tomim is the truck. The asbur mai, the dummy lay. It was like a basket. that had no ears to it. Shlomo came along and put ears to it. Let's see Rashi. Yeah, Rashi explains this. Last Rashi on the page. He made, he made ears to the basket. He was the halachas of erev chetzeros for your dayim and to wash your hands for kachim. The gazra shniyos la royas. It was Geyser, we're going to see in Dakar Falam and Yvamis, all the Shneas La Royas, can your farish be Yvamis? While Yudei Kach Oichs and Yisrael, the Mitzvahs, as a result, we're able to hold on to the Ikka Mitzvahs as a result of the Gedorim that, that Shlomo made, right? Shen Yisrachum in Avera, by going ahead, by, if you had a Shneas La Royas, it's going to keep you away from real La Royas. And if you keep Eva Chatzay Royas, it's going to keep you away from Hoitza. And if you kill Siddayim, it's going to take you, keep you away from going ahead and eating something with Tumma. So again, all, 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 all situations. He went ahead by putting the, the ears to the Torah, it helped us keep the Torah. Just like it's easy to hold on to a Kli, that you're able to carry it. So beautiful, right? That the, Just like the ear to the Kli goes to help you carry the Kli, so too the Takanas of Shlema helped us keep Kola Torah Kula, all, all, the, all the mitzvahs of the Torah. Beautiful. Paz says, It says, It says, Your locks are wavy. Your locks are wavy. Amar of Chista, Amar Mar, Ukva Melamid, Sheesh Lidrais Al Koitz, take the word Koit uh and let's break it up into two words. Al Koit Koitz for Koitz on each Koitz, Tilin Tilin Shell Alakis. I think if I remember Gamar it's Gamar Menachis, but Mesha Bin went went up to Shamayan and to get the Taira and uh, he found the Kaj Brahu putting tagging on the Taira. And and a Kaj Mesh Rabbeinu asked the Bhana Shalom, like, what are you doing? He said, that also Eliya said, man if the car Kind of dry rice, and you know, like, you keep him on the ice of Shemai, and he's going to go ahead and dash and tealing, tealing the shell of on each kite. Each kite. So, not only goof with Tyra is Tyra, but even not only the letters of the Tyra, but even the kites and the literally the thorns, the tagging on certain letters of the Tyra, they go ahead and they dash in halakas. The Pusik says, Shechai rice ka'irev, that they're black like a raven. Mimiya tamaitza, where do you find Tyra by, fellas? Bimisha mashkim umarev alayem. The base Hamedrish. Someone who a mashkim will get up, umar ariv, and go ahead in the morning and the evening to base Hamedrish. Rashi says, Shemashkin ma ariv, Shechoyres is lush and Shachris. Black is lush and Shachris. Keoyrev, like a raven, is lush and Arvis. So it's a play on words. Like you get up, people get up in the morning to learn and go to sleep, go base Medrish. That's where you find Tyra. Rabba Amar, the Misha Mashkir Pana Balein Keoyrev. Someone who goes ahead and makes it black like an Oyrev. He works so hard that his face turns. Dark. We we don't say the word black anymore, but you know, it turn, turns dark. And uh, I I was thinking I was thinking of maybe an original shot. Well, it says make your face dark on oh, it. Maybe that, that's the shot, that shot, 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 but that that's the first shot. That's the first shot. I was thinking another shot. It says uh, You eat very little. You drink very little, right? Yeah, right. People who who starve, they're dark. Why? The face the face get black. They, 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 the face get black. So the derech atayra is is to go ahead and one. He said, my rebbe told me by Rav Shimon, they had nothing to eat, zero. They they were very very poor because they lived tayra. They breathed tayra. It was nothing. He said it was nothing. There was nothing there. He, he said when he learned Rav Chaim Shlevitz, Zechut Tzadik Hashlevracha, he said that. He would bring a, a, a loaf of bread and he would bring a herring and they would they would learn for I don't know. The, the seder started at one a.m. The seder started at one a.m. Right? Think about it. Right? 
and, and I'm saying, but, but that's the Derech Etayra. That's the Derech Etayra. Fighter. So, so like a black, like a, like a, like an oil that's black. You have mashki and maru. We have another shot to make you to black in your face. Rava amab b'misha mesim atzmei atzori albonov yabnei beisoy koirev. Now we know the oil is a tremendously what is a tremendously cool bird. A kosher has to take care of the the ravenettes, you know, the ravenettes because they 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 have no their parents don't feed them. So a kosher broker says he takes care of them. So a person who wants to learn Torah sometimes has to be cool like a raven, okay, like the, this, like the following Maisak. Yehuda Rav Adar Masna having caused the Lebei Rav who's going to the Shiva. Amr Lei the Bisai his wife told him Yenuki Didach My Avodle. What's going to be the kids? Who's going to feed the kids? So Amr Lo he told her Ni Shal Shalimu Kormi Baagma. Is there no Kormi left in the Agma? Rashi says there's no wild vegetables or some type of of grass that you can go ahead and and, and grind up and cook. You have what to eat. So in other words, he took off. Again, no comment. Says Gemara. Who mashlim the sign? I guess he meant human. Who mashlim the sign of al 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 panov laha avidoi? And so what does that mean? Amr Amr Rabbi Yeshua ben Levi il mole mikra kosa v'yev shalom. If not that that the pasuk was written, you couldn't say it. Kaviyachol Hakadosh Baruch Hu pays back the the sign of al panov. What does that mean? That umu vakish lashlich kaadam shenoisi masa al panov. He's carrying something. Umu vakish lashlich mimun. He wants to go ahead and get rid of it. So Kaddish Baruch Hu pays back the Rishoyim. It's like a load on him to reward the Rishoyim. He wants to get rid of it. The Pasuk says, Lo ya'achel l'sayinoi. He doesn't delay for those who he hates. I'm going to be loyal. The sign of who the lo ya'achel. For those he, he, that he hates, he doesn't delay. He plays back. He pays back the Rishoyim in this world. He pays back the Rishoyim in this world. He's not ma'achel. He's not delaying and paying the, the, the sign of those he hates in this world. Avo ya'achel l'sadikim. He will go ahead and in fact be delay to Sadiqim Gimurim, and of course he'll pay them back in the Oilam de Kushta where it really counts. Erech af mi boyle, a pine is much a double. What do you mean, Erech af? Actually, af, one lush, not a pine, a double anger. El Erech a pine with Sadikim, Erech a pine with Shoyim. He shows his af with Sadikim, right, yeah. that he delays the Scott to the next world and he delays the punishment of the Rishoyim to the next world so he can give them out the scar in this world. And now we back get back to, to, I got it, we get back to reality. Re- reality. <laughs> okay, listen. No, listen, you can't complain in, in Baruch Hashem. Okay, let's go through, since we're going back to Erevin, let's go, let's get everyone back in. Okay, listen up. I don't listen up, I'm going to bring you back. Well, we're dealing with the sugya of Pasi Barois. Pasi Barois, we said, is a tremendous, tremendous ether where you had a problem. You had a bar that was a Rishusa Ayafi, that it was 10 by 4. It was water in the bar. You want to give your animal to drink. If you're going to draw it out from the bar and put it on the ground, you're going to be going from Rishusa Ayafi to Rishusa Rabbim, you're going to be high for it. What did they do to go ahead and make it to Rosh Hashanah? The Chacham came up with a tremendous kula of called Pasi, the boards, Birois of the wells. You would have four Diyumdim, like a do, a Omdim, two Omdim, like an L shape over yeah. here in this corner and the other one in this corner. And according to the distance between them, according to Rabbi, Rabbi May, it was three cattle this way, three cattle this way, uh, six times one and two thirds was 10. And according to Yehud, there was four cattle this way, four cattle that way, and it was 13 and a third, right? And that was uh, the dinner pasi b'rois. We mechadish that despite the fact that it was paritz maruba ala oimed, there was more open space than closed space, according to everybody. Nonetheless, the makom of oil regel, they will make. Well, that's the dinner pasi b'rois. That, that's the sugya. Now, how the distance of the area, we had a machloikis in the Mishnah. Said Rabbi Yehuda, the most you can go ahead and enclose in the Pasi Barois is a shetach of the Mishkan, which was was hundred times or seven base asayim, an area that you can pick uh, pan to saw. It's a hundred times five hundred five thousand square amis, five thousand square amis, or seventy in, 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 a, in a bit and times seventy in a bit. That's the that's the that's the area. The other people said no, you can enclose a much larger area than that, even. Or, but you can paint a core, which is 30 saw, or Korayan, which is 60 saw, you can go ahead and enclose in that area. Now, the question is, Lloyd Rabbi Yehuda, when he said that area, the, the base of Siam, 
Is that including the pit or not including the pit? Perish. Is the 2,000 from the pit? Meaning the pit is 2,000. Let's say the pit is 2,000. Then the, the, it's got to be right around it, but it can't be right around it because you need two amis for the animal or it's excluding the pit and the whole, the whole area is 2,000. So is it, I keep on saying 2,000. Is it 5,000, meaning the base of Siam, or 5,000 and a bit? Because you can have, you can have two, you can have that, you can have two Amis in addition. Iboy Lulu. Boru Pasin Kamar is the two, is the base of Siam, the 5,000, the Bor including the Pasin. I do my Bor Veloy Pasin, Bor without the Pasin. Kamar. Adam Nysin ain't of the Boy. What's the shot? A person puts his eyes in the, on, in the Bor. We're not guys that Dilma Asila to Tule Yosem Vesa Sayin the Karfif. A Karfif is an area that is not made Ladira. Fellas, if an area is not surrounded for a Dira, you're only you're limited to the amount of area you can carry. If you have a big estate and it's your estate and you 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 put up fences, you can carry the whole estate. You can carry the whole estate. It's your estate, it's Ladira. A Karfif is not a place where people live in. It's a, it's a place that's a, it's a, it's a back lot. You don't live in there. So when you put fences around it, it wasn't the purpose of living there. Therefore, you're limited to the area of 5,000. You're limited. So over here, are we worried that if we give you more area over here, you may have to go ahead and give more area in the Karfif? I don't know other and of and a person goes ahead and he places us in the because we don't know us to look for your son based on the Karfif. Toshma, what's the, how close to the, the cows have to be to the pit? Which we said is two amis. The kamehim ruchakim, and how far can you distance? In other words, kamehim uh, mikuravim. How, if you're going to bring in the deyundim fellas closer and closer and closer, the minimal amount is the pit and two amis around the pit. If you're going to extend out, what's the amount you can extend out? So, what's the amount you can extend out? A filu kara, filu karayim, endless. Again, this is a huge expanse. Think about it. This is thirty sa. This is third. It's fifteen times five thousand. It, it's, it's it's much more. A few kurayim, which is even the sixty. If you don't even know base of siyim, the maximum amount you can expand is base of siyim. Muta yes, me base a siyim also. Up base of siyim is muta to expand. You know some base of siyim, you can't go ahead and expand expand those boards more than that. You can still expand parameters of the third third third. No matter how big you make. No, you can no, you're gonna have to put boards in the middle to go ahead and, and right to break it up. You're gonna have to put you're gonna have to put what's called uh, shooting those those middle boards, the pictures. So Amr um, Rabbi Yehuda, Iyat they told Rabbi Yehuda would say based on sign. Rabbi Yehuda, they said Rabbi Yehuda, Iyat emoidim bedir v'soya muktsa v'chatzer. A deer is a again these are these are places where you have animals. These you would surround with fadira. People would be there. So once you're there, you're not limited to based on sign, right? Because the it was the surrounding was for the purpose of a residence. The residence can be for an animal too. The residence can be for an animal too, or the shepherd who's going to be there. So these aren't you moida? I feel a base chamish kurim, a base asara kurim, even a place that you can pin five core or ten core shem mutter. So why do you have who the limit over here the pasi beroyz to 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 two? Some of them zoom chitz of elu pasin. What? How can you compare the two? By the deer, by the soya, by the mukta, by the chatzay. Your mamish had walls. Over here, we have these shvacha, shvacha, passe boards, which we're because she allowing, because the oil are going, we want them to get water. So how can you compare there to here? So there, of course, you can get kur karayim, or as much as, as much as you need. Because it's the mechitzas are real mechitzas. You're making a richtika, 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 shvishos a yachid. But over here, what are you doing? You're making, you're making a temporary thing, you know? You're making, you know, you're making that sukkah. You know that sukkah when you go to the travel sukkah? <laughs> Uh, the, the little pop-up sukkah, the travel sukkah. Were you, were you the guy who made the sukkah with the, the cars back together? The, 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 yeah. And the apples, yeah. yeah they backed up their, their vans together like this, and they put a uh, skach on top, and, and they, and they ate in the middle. There's a chaz sitting in there. Oh, right. yeah. a Benji, I think we did it, Benji. What? We did both minivans together. Uh, okay, Abrami, go back to driving. Abrami. Mm-hmm. Go back to eating okay. or driving. No, I'm eating or driving. No more than that. Okay, Vaita. Says the Gemara. Now a new shita. We had, until now we had all these shitas. Now we have another shita. Reb Shimon Elazar Einer, bar beisa sayim a beisa sayim. A bar is a beisa sayim by beisa sayim. Muta. 
And the, and all you have to distance is right Rosh Hashanah Rosh Hashanah. Now, now, what is it? Ella, now Muhammad the Gemara of Shimon Allah's a bar v'lo pasim. When Rabbi Shimon Allah said bar without the pasim, Mechal of Yehuda would hold bar u pasim, or else they're saying the same thing. In other words, when Rabbi Shimon Allah said a bar without the pasim. It must be the base society the two of Rabbi Yehuda is the bar with, in our, and we can be punished to Shiloh. His two is including the passing and the bar. It's including everything. It's including everything. The whole, the whole square is, is, is including, is including the, is two, is two society is including the bar because according to Rabbi Elaza, or Shimon Elaza, it's not including the bar, meaning that he's allowing 5,000 and a bit of Shimon Elaza. So Rabbi Yehuda would only last 5,000. Says the Gemara, no, you have no raya. Says the Gemara of Lehi, Rabbi Yehuda bar of Lehi pasim kamar. He hachi heim of Rabbi Shimon alasa. So what's the difference between the two, well, guys? What's the difference? You can get to five thousand one of two ways. You can get to a hundred times fifty, or you can get to it seventy and a bit times seventy and a bit. Seventy a bit times seventy a bit is a square. A hundred is a hundred times fifty is a rectangle. That's the difference. That's the difference. Because what Rabbi Shimon alasa say? He said base asayim by base asayim, meaning it has to be a square. Whereas Rabbi Yehuda, he just says that base aside. He didn't say kib la base aside. It can be nayu arch vikhatim. The, the difference would be arch vikhatim. Like Rabbi Yehuda, it can be 50 times 100 to get to the 5,000. Like Rabbi Shimon Alaza, it could be a square 70 and a half by 70 and a half. Amr Rabbi Shimon Alaza, Kal Amr Rabbi Shimon Alaza, Kal Avir. Now, this has nothing to do with what we, we just discussed. Kal Avir she tashmisha le dira. Kigoin, dir, visoyar, muktsa vikhatsa. Now, any any avir, an area that's open, an airspace that's open, that you're surrounding for the purpose of being in that area, for example, a corral, a storage area for wood, the purpose of the surrounding is not for the outside, the purpose of surrounding is for the inside, it's for the inside. Then I feel a base chamishas kurim, a base esus kurim. The area you'll be able to carry is even endless, endless amount. However, the chol dira she tashmisha laavir, any dira that was made for the purpose of the outside, meaning you want to go in from the sun, you don't really really live in the in that area. We had this by the elon that's mesach, guys. If you remember, we had a tree that came down to within three tefachim. We said that you go in that area. Why do you go into such an area? To avoid the outside. You didn't make it for that area. Really, you made it for the outside, but you want, you want to be outside, but you have to go in because you get hot. So any area that you're making to, to, that, to watch the Aver outside of it, can go in Burgenen, those huts that extend the the of the city, Sheba Sadais, Beis Asayim Muta, Yes and Beis Asayim Masa. So this is what's hook of Ladira that's made for the Abir. If you if you look at back in Tesvav, I'm an Aleph, we had that, we had that Kamar. Okay. So you say this to Gamishna. Rav Yehuda Aimer. Im hoye derech ushusa rabin mafsakason, yisal kenelit stadin. Okay, we quoted this earlier. Let's say the, the Pasi Birois was in the middle. Let's say it was, it, it was in the middle of the, yeah, I, I got it. Okay, I think, 850, what number is that? No, I think. What? Number 40. Number 40, page, picture 40. Okay, here you go. Let's say this picture, guys, you have it. You should be able to see this. You have Rosh Hashanah It's going through the Pasi Barois. Says Rabbi Yehuda, you cannot walk in the middle of this. Says Rabbi Yehuda, you can't. You have a, I have an extra book over here, if somebody wants. You have a book? You need, does somebody need a book? Everyone has a phone? Okay, good. Okay, so you have, I have it at pictures 38, 39. You have, again, you're walking on the side. Why can't you walk through it? Because, guys, if you walk through the Pasi Barois, the traffic will be mevatel the mechitzas. The traffic will be mevatel the mechitzas. Any, any rabbin that's mevatel the mechitzas is leishmei mechitza. So you have to walk around it. That's the sheet of, of Rabbi Yehuda. That's the sheet of Rabbi Yehuda. Again, anything that's going to go ahead and, and uh, if you walk to the mechitza, it's going to mevatel the shei mechitzas from it. If it's mevatel the shei mechitzas from it, then when then then it's no good. Then it's no good. Okay, says the Gemara. However, 
You don't have to go ahead to the side. You can march right through the Pasi Berois and still retain its identity as a Rishos HaYachid. Because Rabim Umavatl Mechitza. So that's the Sadistic Machlaikis. Like Rabbi Yehuda, Asi Rabin, the Rabin comes along, Umevatl Mechitzais, and as it goes through, it's Umevatl Mechitzais. Light the Chachamim, Loy Asi Rabin, Umevatl Mechitzais. Therefore, no, it's not unnecessary to be Masalic to the side. You can go ahead and march right through, and it's not a problem. Right through, it's not a problem. Says the Gemara, Rabbi Yochanan and Rabbi Laza, the Ami Travayu, Khan, we had this earlier. Over here, the chashita of the chachamim hold for the yachid koyich neshel mechitzos. Can we see the koyich of mechitzos? These four diyumdim, these these four L-shaped, right? You know, L, these L-shapes that you put on the corners. They are so powerful that the rabbin can't come along and be mavatel them. They are there. The, can, like the chachamim, man. Can over here like the sheets of Chum, or the Achachachim. Now, who said this? Rabbi Yochanan and Rabbi Laza. Now, can the Svirale, does it mean that they reported it and hold like that? So Rabbi Yochanan would hold that you're not Mavatal the Mechitzes. That Rabbi Yochanan, again, Rabbi Yochanan would hold that you're not Mavatal the Mechitzes. The Omar Rabbi Ramchana, Om Rabbi Yochanan, Yushalayim, Ilmoli Dal Saser, Nanalis Belayla, Chayev Olen Mishum Shusarabim. So we have a, a picture over here. Picture, I got picture 40. You may have picture 41. You have, you have a picture here of, of Yerushalayim. Right? You have a picture of Yerushalayim. And, and it's, Yerushalayim is a, is a walled city. It's got four mechitzes all around it, guys. It's got one mechitzes. It's got a, a Rosh Hashanah going through it. Good. And the whole reason, the whole reason, that you're able to go ahead and carry there is because at night they close the doors. The closing of the doors at night make it into Rishus Ayachid. Mashma, if the doors were not closed, even though you have four machitzes, the rabbin would be mevatalit. The whole reason you can carry it, make it into Rishus Ayachid, is because the walls are closed at night. If they weren't closed, if they weren't closed, the traffic would in fact go ahead and ruin the machitzes. And these are real machitzes. These are not these the Yungdim. These are Mamish walls. So you're gonna tell me that Rabbi Yochanan holds this way? The Omar Rabbi Rav Khan Om Rabbi Yochanan says Rabbi Yochanan, you shall lie in Ilmolay the Los Nessa the Nalis Malaila, Kayav Malab Mishimish as a Rabin. So how can it be canvas spherile? So it must be El Khan Veloy Spherile. Perish. The Khachamim Taka hold, it's not Mavato. I hold it is Mavato. But can can here from the Shittas of the Chamin by Pasi Berois, where you do not have to go around it, you can go through it. We see the Chachamim hold the Mechitz is so powerful, you can't take off the shame, even though I don't hold like that as a, as a Mabura from my, my Shittas regarding Yerushalayim. Okay, so let's go, let's go, we got, let's go what we have so far. Says Rabbi Yehuda, if you have a Rabin that comes up to Pasi Berois, you gotta, you know, uh, make, it, make a little uh, jig, 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 zigzag turn. You have to go around it. Why? Can't go through it. Because if you go through it, you're going to make that Rishus Yachin into Rishus Adam. You're going to get rid, rid of it, and you would have ruined the whole purpose of passing the rights. Says Rabbi Yochanan, says the Chacham, no, it's not necessary. Says the Chacham, not say. Rabbi Yochanan reports, wow, the Chacham sheet is such a chiddush to get in. What a what a what a chiddush that yet not can like the Achad the Koyach of Ad of Mechitzes. However, he himself doesn't hold that way because Yerushalayim, in fact, says that the Mechitzes takalubim and vatel is not for the fact you you put doors on it. That's what Rabbi Yochanan. Again, once they close it, then it comes Rishus Yachid. But only the doors. Without the doors, it would have been Rishus Arabim. Why? Because I has four walls, but this pack of the traffic of the Marabim, that's the Mavatola Shem If there's a special, then you could call it the Shem Mavatola 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Once, yeah. Once you close, once that, that, that's the then. Right. Once, once they have to be able to close. We, we had the Gemara earlier, right? We had the soot of the of the, the Nardoi, right? You had the soot of Nardoi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You had to be able to close, even while if uh, that was by a Mavoi. But again, it was say, we worked with the same way. We worked with with, with Machitza. Yanni, look at that. You still you still in it? 
There you go. Eight o'clock. We start at eight o'clock now. This is gonna there. This is gonna there. Okay. Says the Gemara Vaita. With Rami, the Rabbi Yehuda, the Rabbi Yehuda, we're going to ask a stira Rabbi Yehuda who said what? That it is Mavatal. But Rami, the Rabbana, the Rabbanon, who says it's not Mavatal. The Tanya. Okay, we had this many times before. Yes, so I came in Rabbi Yehuda. Misha hoyu shtei batim shtei tzidei v'shusar abim. Oysu lalechi mikan v'lechi mikan. Oy koyu mikan v'koyu mikan v'noysu v'noysu v'emso. Guys, the... Guys, look at my hands. I, I, I don't want to go back to picture. I'm, gonna, I, I'm on a roll with the, with, the, with the sharing, and I don't want to ruin my I don't want to ruin my momentum. Okay. Now you have over here. Look at my hands. You have like over here. My hands are my face is the Rosh Hashanah. We're walking through, right? So this is Rabbi Yehuda. This is one mechitza. This is another mechitza. Good. You put a lechi over here, a lechi over here, or a koyer across and a koyer across. You can carry in between. You can carry in between. Now, isn't a rabbin going through here? Yeah. So how can you carry in between? If a Yehuda holds that a rabbin can be mevatel the mechitza of a basim arise, why in the world does he hold? You can walk through on this, this side and this side. You can walk through. You have a rabbin watching right through this. You know, the mechitzas. So it's a steer, Reb Yehuda. It's a steer, Reb Yehuda. Tell Gemara. Yes, Al came on Reb Yehuda. Misha elish they bought the mishnei bit sidim rishus rabbin. He's got two houses on two sides of rishus rabbin. I saw the lechem mikam v'lechem mikam. I carry mikam v'lechem mikam. Guess what? Nice and nice and empty. You can carry in the middle. So it's a steer. I'm a loy. Hey, my Rabbi Moshe Rabbi Mekat. They told him, okay, Kasha the Yehuda, Adar Rabbi Yehuda, Kasha the Rabbanon, Adar Rabbanon. What did Rabbanon say? You can't go ahead, guys, and be my Arab. Why not? The Chacham said that this, that that Rabbi going through does not stop it. They're saying it's a problem. In other words, from the Chachamim's report to Rabbi Yehuda, you got to steer in the Chachamim, right? The Chacham is saying, I'm Mishnah, and it's Sarech Pasi Berois, march straight through. By, by Rabbi Yehuda's case, we had two existing walls. They said, no, you can't do it. So you got to steer up. Let Rabbi Yehuda, he says in Anishna, you it, the Rabbim is Mavato. Yet the two on the two sides, it's not Mavato. The Rabbi Chum say in Anishna, it's not Mavato. And here they're saying, you are Mavato. So you have a, a steer in Rabbi Yehuda and you have a steer in the Chachamim. Says the Gemara, Rabbi Yehuda, Rabbi Yehuda, like Hasha. Rabbi Yehuda, 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 you mamish have you have two mechitzas. You have two mechitzas. Now we we had one one line in the Gemara previously that dealt with this, and I went through it very quickly, so I don't I, I just barely remember. I don't expect you to remember. Nidor Raisa, how many walls do you need to make a rishus ayachid? According to Rabbi Yehuda, two. The third wall is the Rabbanan. According to Rabbi Yehuda, you only need two two walls. You got two walls. The third wall is the Rabbanan. The Rabbim can't even battle with the Rabbanan to the wall. Once I have two derises, right? Then the, the, the third wall is the, the, that wall that you're putting up the lechi or the koira to create the third wall, right? That is that that the robin can be mavata. Yeah. So they, they can't be mavata. That's what, by, by, by mother, again, this is not a mavi. This is this is this. Is, what? Again. If a if the mechitza falls down, so we had a shaila whether it whether it's it's gone or not. We had a shaila whether it's gone or not. Whether you can carry there or not. What's the two shelter here? He he holds that there's a difference between physically because over here it's intact. You still have your you cover yourself. You still have your 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 lechem for chayim up. What? The fact that it's be even better. So it, it, ain't nothing not, 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 not. He says you could be mavatel. They can't be mavatel. It, stay, it stays good. Uh-huh. Rabbi Yehuda says it stays good, Yanko. He said, right, right. He's, he's saying, yeah, ain't nothing not. So by George, you've got it. You, you understand, you're understanding it. It, stay, it stays intact, right? Adrav, it stays intact. Okay, now, what about the Chachamim? Pachel, leka, shte mechitzes. But a possible Roy, you don't have two mechitzes. Ma'al yasa. You have these, these because she take a mechitzes. The Rabbanon and the Rabbanon, Nami like Kasha, as well as the Kasha and the Rabbanon. Our Mishnah, you go straight to the Pasi Baroyce, so they stay intact. Over here, we don't let you marry Rosh Hashanah Rabbin. Hoche Ika Shem Arba Mechitzais. Hosam Leka Shem Dalar Mechitzais. The Chachamim hold three are the Raisa and four the Rabbanon. Over there, you have a Shem for Mechitzais. Two and two, right, on each end. Over here, you only have what? 
You only have three at most. So therefore, why? You don't have uh, Matisse. That would be the chilek. So again, what's the stero? We have a steer in both. Rabbi Yehuda answers that over here, it's better than Pasi Brois. You get two mechitzas. Over, over by Pasi Brois, the Chum say is better because you have four mechitzas. Over here, you only have uh, two at best. Three with a third. I'm going to talk about Yosef Rabbi Yochanan. Every Tzisroel in Chayov and Lemishu Mishu Sarabim. Says Rabbi Yosef Rabbi Yosef, guess what? You can carry in all the Eretz Yisroel. There's no Mishu Sarabim. You can carry all the Eretz Yisroel. Again, don't leave now. <laughs> you can carry all the Eretz Yisroel. Eretz Yisroel is, there's no. <laughs> Says Gemara. Master Rabbi Dimi Vukamala Shmaitz. So he said of the Shmaitz, what do you mean Eretz Yisroel? There's no there's, there's no Mishra Sarabim. Some lay a bail Rav Dimi, said a bail to Rav Dimi, my, my timer, what's the reason? Elaim Mishum, the marketplace, Soma did sore, may have Kisa, Umach Tona, and a steep drop, the Goder of Goder. So we take a look at what we have. Yeah, on one side you have this big racks, right? You have the Mediterranean, if that's the Amagado, you have that racks that make that's one machitza. And then on the other side, you have that's called the Machtona, the steep trap of Machtona, and that surrounds Eretz Yisrael. So therefore, that should make have a din machitza, and therefore it's Rishu Sayachid. Back in the Gemara, Bavol Nami Makifla Paras Mehachisa, the Diglas Mehagisa. Bavol is surrounded by two great rivers, the Tigris and the Euphrates, right? And and so therefore it should be the walls of the tigers your face should be the they should be the walls for Babel. And in fact, if that's your svara, the Kuli Alma Nakiv Makiv Okyanois. The oceans surround the whole world, guys. So you could say well, it's the whole world should be right? And the whole thing thing's a moot point. Well, obviously, yeah, don't leave now. Right? You know, oh, you know what I just let him share. <laughs> <laughs> we said the whole world works, but we have in Brooklyn, we have Ocean Park. <laughs> okay, anyway, so Lachara, obviously, this is, this is this isn't a good spara. Obviously, so what's the reason why he held Eretz Yisrael was what was Rishu Sayachet? Says the Gemara Amalei. So he 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 said he said to him, Dilma Abaya said to, to Ravdimi, Dilma Milus Umar Ka'amit. Maybe he wasn't speaking about Eretz uh, about all of Eretz Yisrael. He was speaking about the areas in Eretz Yisrael that went up and down, the areas in Eretz Yisrael that went up and down. Maybe those areas he was discussing. He wasn't discussing uh, an area like this, okay. Uh, Masada is a mountain. Hey, look, uh, a picture of 245, right? You have a picture like that, and we spoke about this, guys. This is like a, a telemislake. A telemislake, if you have a 10 tfachim, it, it ascends 10 tfachim within four amis. Right? It's a 25 degree angle. If it, descend, if it ascends, ascends 10 tfachim within four amis, maybe there he said you could carry, but not all of Eretz Yisrael. So maybe there he said you could carry. You mean on top of the slope? As you know, that would have a dinner Rishul Sayachid. That yeah, that would dinner that that since since Aaron it slopes that at four, within four rounds from ten ten and ten by four makes it Rishul Sayachid. Maybe that's what he meant. Meaning the these ascensions, these places where you can go up in Eretz Yisrael, that's where this halacha applied. Now, uh, obviously. The, the Rav Dimi came from Babel. Rav Dimi came from Babel, and he said this in the name of. He said this in the name of of uh, Rav Yechinan. Now, Rav Dimi's reply is the following: Amalei said Rav Dimi to Abaya, "Karkafna chazisa l'reishech be'amude." And Adam Choshev, I saw at the head between the amude, meaning Kiyom Rav Yechinan l'shmaitz. Rav Yechinan said this. So it's mashma. In other words. You're right. You're right. That's exactly what Rabbi Yochanan said. It's not speaking about all of Eretz Yisrael. It's speaking about the milus that go up in that go up in Eretz Yisrael. That's what it's speaking about. Those areas. That's what it's speaking about. Okay. That that's that's what it's speak. Those areas. That's what it's speaking about. Now, obviously, fellas, 
Rabbi wasn't there. Look at look at Taisus. Kakaf mechasis le reishech, reishech hainu rabba, means rabba. That was the, that was a bias rebbe rabba. Shalhaya rabba shalabaya was the rebbe of Abaya. The havi kimoi reishech bekriri vereishech the reishech bechamimi umatzina shaholach rabba leret Yisrael. We find that rabba went leret Yisrael. Lul my tyra lufnei rebbe yachinon. So Rav Dimi was saying karkafta al adam choshev not Abaya. Your Rebbe, Taka, was there when Rebbe Yochanan said that the Milos of Eretz Yisrael that go up are considered Rishos HaYachid. They are considered Rishos HaYachid. <clears throat> That's the Gemara of Micah. So we're not speaking all of Eretz Yisrael, only the Milos of Eretz Yisrael. Itman Nami, Kiyosa Ravin, Ravin was another person who would bring the reports of Rebbe Yochanan. Kiyosa Rav Dimi and Ravin on Rebbe Yochanan. Others say it was a vote named Rabbi Yachanan. Milosu Marodesh, Eretz Yisrael, going up and going down in Eretz Yisrael. Ein chayav mole mishum mishus arabim. The fish ain't a kidigli midbar because they're not the diglet like the like in the midbar. In the midbar, right, we said that it has to be a Zionamis, it has to be um, 600,000 people, and, and it wasn't like that. Now, boy, me ne rachba me rava. Rachba, a moira rachba yasum rava. Tail in the slacket, a sorrow betoch arba. A tail in the slacket, again, that's what we just noted that we saw. You have a, a slope that ascends, a sorrow betoch arba. And guys, by the way, go to all adaf. There's a, there's a, there's, there's a, a app called All Daf. And on it, they have a beautiful halakhla maisa, a person showing you a tail in the slacket, how they measure it to use as a machitza. It's fascinating. If you ever saw underneath the, the bridges, they have a piece of, of, uh, Cement going up, it's, it, they're using that as a tell them the to be considered a rishusa a mechitza to be to make it as part of, part, part of the of the era. It's, it's, fa- it's fascinating. It's a five minute clip on all that. All this is fascinating. You go there, it's a, you'll you'll see it. It's fascinating. They, they're measuring it. They, they go around it, and, that's, and then you know, usually you think of mechitza, you think of just the tourist pesa, right? The the wire with the with the poles. The, again, this is a wonderful. This is a, a this is a full fledged mechitza. Right, it, it, so, so is the source of Pesach. This is a full-fledged mechitza. They they use the like I, underneath the overpass. Sometimes you see a piece of of cement that goes like this, and they they show different ways to measure it. And okay, so tell him it's so Rachbi asked to tell him it's like that. Sorbet like Arba, the Rabbin Boykinba, and now but many people walk through it. Now does this thing have this go into the machloekus of Rabbi Yehud and the Chachamim? Whether what asi rabim u u mevatel mechitzas, so it's the Gemara. Chayavim le mishum mishum rabim or ain't chayavim chayim alavim. Chayavim mishum mishum rabim because it's bottle or not. So it's the Gemara. Aliyud rabban loy ki boy lachloy rabban. It's not a shaila hashda. Now guys, with, let's compare. Guys, look at me. Let's compare pasi berois to tell them it's lach. Right. Where where we have established our opinion? We establish our opinion by pasi berois. Right. The Chacham said. You can march right through these Pasi Barois, no problem. So question, is it, can you march through this Tel Maslach there's no problem? Where is the more svar to say that the Mechitzas remain intact? Where is the more svar to say where the Mechitzas remain intact? By Pasi Barois or by what? Tel Maslach. Good. So says the Gemara beautifully. Says the Gemara. I'll leave it the Rabbon is not a Shaila, like the Boilach, that is Hashda, Umahas, and by Pasi Barois. The Nicha Tashmisei. It's easy to use. It's a flat surface. You walk right through. They remain intact. The are not mavadlit. Hacha over here, where you have to ascend. It's a much harder walk. The lenichetashmisha say it's not so easy to use. Like kol shekain that what that they're not mavatel. Yeah, Gishmak. So rach b'shayla to rava wasn't such a shayla kun to chachamim. Madoch where it's easy to use. We can say the mechitzas remain intact. Culture came where it's hard to use the mechitzas will remain intact. Kiti boilach. When's it a shaila? I'll leave the Rebbe Yehuda. Ma ma ma. Hasam by pasi berois. Who the nicha tashmish say? Since it's so easy to use, therefore boom, you're gone. Hacha who the lay nicha tashmish say? Leyasi rabim rabim yitzasa. Yeah, it's a little more schmer. Maybe it stays intact. I do malishna, or maybe there's no difference. So that's what Rachba is from Rava. So Malay, Rabbi told him Chayavim, he be Chayvas of Shusar Rabbim. Light Rabbi Yehuda, Elam Islake will be bottle if a Rabbim go ahead and use it. 
the same as passive Barois. You had to go around because you're going to be in battle Mechitza. So too over here, you're in battle Mechitza as well. So too in battle Mechitza. Now, the Afilu oil in the and even if it's so steep, guys, it's so steep. Look how you have to get up this place. Mom and you, look at this. In order to get up there, you see that? Picture 46. Do you, even if you need a rope to get up, will it be, go ahead and still be considered? If a, if a robin go up that rope, will it be a bottle it? Again, you have a, 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 an ascension over here. So what did he say? He said, I'm going to in. He said, Rava, it'll be a bottle. It won't be a bottle. You'll be higher. But feel the mile of space more on, which is mamish picked 47. I'm getting even nervous just looking at it. I see the guys going up this rope, the side of a mountain. Even over there, will, will, will the will the robin be mavatle it? Amalayin, it'll, it, it'll go ahead. The robin will come along and mavatle it. So then, Rabbi Yehuda Shita is pretty much pretty much intact. Also, mavatle, it'll come mavatle, with the exception when you have real mechitzas, right? We have two real mechitzas on two sides of Shusar Rabin. So the Chacham said it will not be. It will not. The robin will not be mavatle. So guys, good so far. We have two sheetas, the Chachamim and Rabbi Yehuda. We've questioned, we're in the middle of asking a, a bias from Rachba, from Rava, and, and, and the same Rabbi Yehuda holds with the exception of the case of Rishus Rabin, where you had two fully fledged walls, which the Raisa are, are, are Rishus Ayachid, according to Rabbi Yehuda. All the other cases, Asi Rabin, Umavat, and Mechitzes, Rabin will come along in Umavat, and Mechitzes. Asi, they... Not a natural means of, or it's an inconvenient way of traveling, it will automatically nullify the resistance. What do you mean? Meaning, we're talking about a case where you, it's very slow, right? So you have to use both to get up there, right? Right. So it's going to the inconvenience of the travel. So even though it's inconvenient, since the Rabbin use it, like Rabbi Yehuda, we're in battle the Even though the slope is a Ptolemy's Laki 10 by 4. We're in battle, yes. We're in battle, right. What if it wasn't the slope? What if it was a, there was a lot of gravel on there? There was hard to walk on. I mean, not, not just the slope itself. No, I, no. Inconvenience I, because of the. the but again, it's, it, again, if, how how is the walls made? The, the rabbin, again, according according to him, any rabbin that marches through will be mavatel unless it's two fully fledged mechitzas. These places, all these places, aren't fully fledged mechitzas. The reason why you're getting mechitzas here is only because of the the slope. So again, in your scenario, do you have, I have to ask you, do you have, you know, do you have, right? Do you have a fully fledged machitz or not? The, the habitat itself, because of the slope, that's what I mean. There's, I, I tell you, there's another, the Tyson says something very interesting. Okay, well, let's go back to it. Hard enough. Hey, <laughs> Sidney. <laughs> Right. Next time around. <laughs> okay, we have another picture. One more picture for the evening. I think this is it. There you go. Picture 48. You got a chatzah. They're going in. They're going out. So you go in one side, you go out the other side. Okay? So this pirza is is obviously ten, and you go right through it. So let's see, let's see what we got. What's the shaila? Eisav echotz asher rabbi nechnasim lo bezu biyotzim bezu rishus rabbi le tuma. Regarding tuma, sofik tuma that's going to rise there, it's going to be considered what a rishus ha rabbi, and the speka is going to be tahar. That's our rule of thumb. Sofik tuma that arises in rishus rabbi. We learn from the guys. The site is a sofik tuma, right? Where does that arise in rishus ayachid? Suffolk Tum of Rishus Ayachet, Sveikai Tame, Suffolk Tum of Rishus Ayachet, Sveikai Tar. So let's say in, in, in Shalom, where you touch the Sheretz or not, in the Sira, you'll be Tahar. Rishus Ayachet, the Shabbos, and it's Rishus Ayachet, the Nyan Shabbos, right? So this is Rishus Ayachet, the Shabbos. So if a Rabbin goes through this, now, when you say it's Rishus Ayachet, that means that guys, what? You're not Mavatul and Mechitzes. Guys, when it's, let's, go, let's translate. When it retains its status as Rishus Ayachet, Means that what you're not mevatel the mechitzas, good? You're not mevatel mechitzas. Now, money. Ilim rabbanon. What are you talking about? Tashta uma hasa by pasi berois. The nicha tash mishta say it's easy to use. I'm rabbanon loyasi rabbi mevatel mechitzas. Hacha do I nicha tash mishta say it's a little harder to use. Like kol shekain it's not mevatel. Elo lav it must be Rabbi Yehuda he. 
Guys, so Rabbi Yehuda, what do you see? I see Rabim, the loy mevatel mechitzes, because it's still a rishis layachid. One more time. Rabbi Yehuda holds that a uh, Rabim that goes through an area on mevatel l'shem mechitzes, and therefore it's going to become rishis Rabim. That's what he said by Patsy Royce. That's why he had to go around. Good. What is he saying over here? Le'inyin tomo it's a rishis Rabim. Le'inyin Shabbos it's a rishis layachid. And obviously, it must be Rabbi Yehud who says this, because there's no kiddush according to the Chachamim. Yet, it's still considered Rishul Sayyachim. Why? Because the Rabbim going through are not mevatalit. Tremendous kasha. Not Rabbi Yehuda. And for the Gemara, no, no, no. Lo ilom Rabbana. Ay, we want to know what the kiddush is. Rishul Sayyachim letumet zvichalei. And the kiddush is nothing to do with Shabbos. Guys, the kiddush was that it's even though the Shabbos was just a Yachid, the Indian Tumbits were just a Rabbit. It was a Tyrus Nikadin, it's not a Shabbos Nikadin. Usually, I was going to ask Kasha, like the Chacham is no Chiddush, you must be Rabbi Huda. And for the Gemara, no, there is a Chiddush, but it's like not the Chiddush you would think about. It's the Chiddush right of, 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 of Tumma rather than Shabbos. Toshma, Mavoyas am Mufulashois. We have a Mavoy that is Mufulish. We know what a Mavoy and Mufulish is open on both ends. The Mavoy, the, the Mavoy guys, is op, open on. On both ends, and in the Mavoy guys, picture fifty. What do you have? You have in in the Mavoy you have a bar. You have a bar. Picture fifty. You have a bar. In order to go pass by, you have to go mamish. Got to fetch. You see that base? You fetch it on the sides there. I mean, there are people in the bar also. I don't know what they're waiting for, but you have the base. You're going through the sides, right? So that's not nicha tashbishe. That's difficult. Now be aware the bar makes it into a rishos ayachid because the bar is going to be considered a mechitza, right? Bar, or else it's a foolish, you won't be able to carry anything. So it says the Gemara now. Muvoyis ham fulashes bidvoyis besichin ma'arais rishos ayachid the Shabbos rishos rabim the toma the same halacha it's rishos ayachid the rabim the Shabbos and rishos rabim the toma. Now the boyrais salke daitoch. What do you mean? What do you mean boyrais? You don't live in the bar. Elo live boyrais rishos ayachid. For that little boy, is says, Dinner Shusha Yachid, the Shabbos, Rishus Arabim, Le Toma. Now, money. Elaim Rabbana and Hashta, who might host them by Pasi Beroyce, the Nikha Dashmi say the same Kasha. That's very easy to use. To use. Ami Loyasi Rabbim, Vat Lule, when they say the Rabbim don't come along, they come march right through. Hacha, the Nikha Dashmi say over here, where it's not so easy to use. You see, they're going to have to go through the side, rub against the wall, like Kol Shakin, that, it, that it's not Mavat and Machitza. El Allah Rabbi Yehudi. And the Chayyim see a variety of Yehud, but that it still retains its, its identity as a Rishus Hayachid, and it's still attending its identity as Rishus Hayachid. It must be what he holds it is is not bottle. Says my loy loy l'rabbanon, and what's the Chiddush? Rishus Harabim l'tumit zvichle. The Chiddush is that what it's a tumit to Chiddush, the same parish. It's not a Shabbos to Chiddush that the Tanakh had it l'tumit Rishus Harabim. Toshma, Shvili base Gilgal. Okay, I think we have one more picture. I'm sorry, I told you the last picture. Let's go one more. You have Shvili Bis Kilgol, according to one pshat, according to the other pshat, it's this. The Shvil is the, this, again, going around this area, right? It's a Shvil. So now, Shvili, the Pevs, Bis Gilgol, of Bis Gilgol, Chayyotze Ben and Summa to them, Rishus Hayoch and the Shabbos, Rishus Arab and the Tuma. Bis Shvili Bis Gilgol, Ami de Beriyane, Kol Shein Eved Yoch a little saw shall keep them, and Eved's not able to take a saw of heat in the Yoritz with me. Sirajoyt. He's not able to run to the sergeant, to the throw officer, because it's too thin. Now, money. Ilim Rabbanon and Hashta. Uma Hashem may pass him a royce. The same Kasha. The Nichid Hashmisa. I'm Rabbanu Leis Rabbim Vadalei. Chitzasa. Hachad Lo Nichid Hashmisa. Like Kol Shekain. El Alav. It's Rabbi Yehuda. And now, what are you going to answer? There's no Tumah. That's right. There's no Tumah here to say Tumah. So we see it's a Rishus Hayachid, despite the fact that Rabbim use it. So what do you see? That Loi Asi Rabbim and Vatlam Chitzah, because it's still a Rishus Hayachid. Hashan of Yehuda says the Gemara, Shvili Beis Gil Kamit Yeshua Oyev Yisrael Haya. Yeshua was an Oyev Yisrael. Oh, you guys, outside, outside. Yeshua divides the Beretz Yisrael, right? He demarcates all the lands. He knew that you'd have to have interstate commerce. He knew you'd have to have, you have to have roads. So he set up a, a system, an infrastructure of roads. He took away from other people, and he said, and, and he made roads. He, oh, he, so he was not Yisrael, he made roads. Says the Gemara. So now, Yeshua Yisrael Haya, 
Omar betikin lehem drochim v'seratya. He made roads and sratya are these, these, these interstate highways. Kol hecha denichet hashmishseh, where it was easy to use, Masr al Rabbim, he gave it to the Rabbim. Kol hecha delainichi tashmishseh, like Masr al Yachid, where it was hard, then he gave it to the individual. Trust me, going up and down around that path, even if Rabbim use it, is still owned by an individual. So it's not considered what? Rishus Harabim. It's not considered Sakhirabim. It's not considered Sakhirabim. The male is not Shver and Rebbe Yehuda at all because it's not what? It's not, it's not Rishus Harabim. You don't want to plow the top roads. Yeah. You don't want to plow the top roads. Okay, it's good? Yeah. Thank you. Rabbi. Beautiful. Thank you. 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 Thank you